Hi everyone, welcome back to Lavender. It's Eileen. So today I want to share what's in my travel bag. So if you don't know, I've been traveling for the past three weeks. I went on a road trip in Europe with my family. So basically every day I carry this backpack with me. It's a pretty big backpack. And today I'm just gonna unpack it and show you exactly what I have in here. And I've basically made like a replica of how I would pack it every day for my travels. So let's get to it. All right, so here is my backpack. This I mentioned in my July favorites that I got it at a random stand at a Chinese supermarket. So I don't know where you can find this online, so I'm sorry, but yeah. So when I open it, this is what it would look like, okay? So this is the little sleeve where I would put my phone for easy access. I'll take that out. And this is a jacket. So this is like a really light jacket that I got from Forever 21. So basically this is like a sporty jacket that's super, super thin. It's like not exactly waterproof, but it has a hood. And I use this whenever it was kind of cold or when it was raining, I would just put this on top of whatever I was wearing. So I love that it's just so light. I could literally just roll it up and it'll fit in any bag. Obviously, if it was like super hot, I wouldn't bring my jacket, but most of the days when I was traveling in Europe were pretty gloomy and rainy, so I definitely had this in my purse for most of the trip. All right, next I'm gonna take out the star object, the object that I revolved this whole bag around, my camera. So let me open this up. This is my Sony camera that I take with me for my travels and honestly the reason I got this bag was because I wanted a bag that was big enough to fit this camera. So this is a 24 to 70 lens. It's a zoom lens perfect for travel photography and videography. So this is like just my sidekick. Literally I take this with me everywhere and I love this camera. It's my best friend. Next, I always need to carry a bottle of water when I'm traveling. So this is not the bottle I was traveling with. I was like using a bunch of European water brands, but I threw them away. This is just like a demo water just to show you that hydration is important. Yeah, totally. Especially when you're traveling, it's so important to stay hydrated because you're like walking every day. So what I do is I always keep this regular size water bottle in my purse, but what I actually do is I buy like those big water bottles. I'll keep those in the hotel room or the bus, and then whenever this one runs low, I fill it up with like the bigger water bottles. Next most important thing is in this pouch in here. These are my external chargers. Basically, this is for charging your phone. I don't leave without this, especially when I'm traveling. The worst fear is like having a dead phone, having your phone run out of battery. So this is like super important. I'm always charging this every night at the hotel. Next up, I have this other pouch, and this pouch carries my camera accessories. Right now, I have my two extra batteries for my Sony camera and an extra SD card. So because I'm like a camera video junkie, I need these accessories. It's totally unnecessary for people who don't take that many photos or videos when they travel, but for me, this is important. As you can tell, I love pouches because they keep everything nicely organized. I can't get enough pouches, so yeah. Next, I have this thing in this little pocket in the front, yet another pouch. <laughs> this one carries my earbuds for listening to music, audiobooks, my meditation music while I'm in the bus. We were on a road trip, so we had a lot of time on the road, actually. We were on the road for like five or more hours every day, so I definitely use this a lot. Lastly, I have this zipper in the back of the purse, and this is where I keep my wallet. This is the pouch that I use as a wallet. I like using these pouches because they're minimal, they're flat, so they don't take up so much space. And all I do is put some cash, my coins, and a couple cards in there. Here are the things I'll keep in the front pouch of my backpack. It's pretty simple. I have my lip balm, which is most important. I have a hair tie just in case. I have a panty liner. Usually I have multiple of these because it's just, you need to stay refreshed when you're traveling. I have this, which is like a throat syrup. It's a Chinese, I think it's loquat and honey. And this is just in case I have like an itchy throat, I have a cough, you know, this is good and I have lipstick to go. These are just some random mementos that I got. 
I think I got this from the EU office. This is um, when I went up the mountain. So yeah, if I ever like go to important places and I need to put my ticket somewhere, I'll just put the ticket right in the front pouch to have easy access. That's about it. I also have this extra compartment in the back where I stash my receipts. So I was traveling with a big group of family and most of the times we would pay for each other just because it was faster or easier. So even though we wrote down all the expenses on our phones, I just wanted to keep the receipts just as a second backup, you know, because it's always good to have your receipts just in case. All right, that's it for today's video. I hope you liked it. So if you are interested in more packing or travel videos, then I'll post the links to those playlists in the description. I also have a packing checklist for you guys to download if you're going on a trip soon and you want like a, just an easy checklist of everything to pack, that's also in the description. Let me know if you guys wanna see a travel vlog of my trip. I have a ton of footage. I'm not sure if I wanna make it like one big vlog or section it off into little vlogs. If I make little vlogs, I might just put them on my vlog channel so that I don't clutter this channel with it so the link to my vlog channel is down below I don't update often but I mean when I have a vlog I put it there <laughs> all right have a beautiful day and I'll see you next time bye